That's all he wanted to say. Okay. Does he mean like the pistol? Because that like, could have been really nice innuendo. Possibly. I don't know. Be rushed though, map. Are you ready? Smokes out. Flashes as well. Automatic tries to hold it. He will. Successfully. And the trace pulls all the way to the ground, but then snaps up, finds cold. He's looking for an ace. And automatic's got all five. And that was there. No Molotovs in the van. Let's see, like, sure, this is great work by automatic, but you know, one by one again. And he's got a chance to reset his aim so much, even without a deagle and find all those fragments. It's a little bit disappointing from Escape. Off a few of the phase players, maybe get some guns for it. Still not gonna have armor to work with that, but better than nothing, it's Olaf is the man outside. Off the garage, they're gonna run toward him. Potential for an ace for Olaf in this situation. He's losing a good amount of HP, but no problem. He'll get for Olaf, my staff. They line up, he knocks them down. As this half, is, it's obviously very inconsistent right now. If, Everyone but Skidoo is all pain, but it seems like they're more default approach. He can't be scared of the orb, man. Not in the quarterfinals, not right now. And he do pre playing anti flash, ready and waiting. With the Molotovs going in and the rush out for Twist, Dupree. He's going to be blind. Twist gets the opening kill for Jisk. He has to respond, but he's also completely flashed. Twist doubles down with the M4. And Device on the site misses a shot. Nitro doesn't realize. Liquid still with two members up, though. And even though Device has site control, there's two players ready to chase him down. Steel tries to round the corner, but Device is too fast. And Twist. Stuck in the pit. Oh, what a pre-fire. Device dead. Can Twist even do this? The players are low. Zitnik's tagged up and Glaive on 7 HP. This is so doable for Twist. It all comes down to this one on two. He's going to try and spot Glaive. Does spot the head. He knows where one of these players are. Glaive takes the peak and he's gone down. Now it's a 1v1. The ace is so close, but Zipex is wrapped all the way around up to apartments. Twist has no idea. Back against him. He's spotted him though and Twist is going to do it. He gets the ace, and Hugo Howard! I was thinking it was going to be more about the action at Monster. It will be now. Certainly with that kill, it confirms it funnels them in. Everyone's blind, but Golden doesn't like to peek. Holds a tight angle, and it works because Lacro on the second off this time. Is able to catch Nico deep inside of the site. The man who I thought was going to go for the contact play is suddenly the last alive. Oh, this is a done round Guardian now. It's the question as to whether he'll save the AWP. Good flashbang. Could get oh. a couple more out of this one. And oh. Fnatic are starting to crumble. What's going on? One player has found three kills. Guardian looking to ace this one out. This could be one of the best rounds of the entire tournament so far. Four kills picked up. It's down to Crimped. This was a five versus one map. And he's got time as well. The bomb won't be on his back, and he's going for the long con here. Back through T-spawn. What a play to hit that third shot. A little bit of luck on his side, perhaps, but he knew where Golden was. And you're right, this fell apart. They forced this, and Guardian is so damn good on the AWP. The long con, he won't overcommit to it. He went back thinking Crimson oh no, would reveal himself. He's just Molotov himself off the bomb. He wanted the force out from barrels. Crims now knows he's inside of the site, but Guardian has every opportunity, you're right, to make this a remarkable one versus five. Oh, wow. Crims will hear him heading toward A, but that means he won't get there in time to deny the plant. There's nothing that can be done, at least for that facet. How quickly does Guardian post up and realize where Crims is going to be coming from, though? He knows he wasn't in B, so he's got to be toward bathroom. Surely Guardian looks that direction with it. Down in position, Crims not looking yet, and Guardian oh just God. gets behind the box. That also means Crims will get closer to the site by the stairs. Guardian will wait for this to go to time. Incendiary could be a factor, because if he puts it in front of Guardian, how does he work back in? It's gone toward the dumpster. That means Guardian knows exactly where to look! Oh! He's got all five! There he is! The world's best sniper comes to life in the five versus one! Fnatic, that is a huge fumble. You cannot afford those mistakes. They could have just sat in the bomb side. They had the bomb. They had five players alive. And it's got to be one of the biggest blunders in grand final history. My God. How have they let it happen? And Guardian to Stella finds the final shot, played it to perfection, even after Molotoving the bomb. And yes, take a pause. Even Fades can call it this time. Let them stew over that. Let them argue. And that's not uncharacteristic. Flush out and Lecro 
We'll try and see what's available to them towards inside. Flusher has sneaked in, but of course, the bomb's so far away. It's not like this does an amazing amount of work for him. But if he does get all the way towards CT spawn, perhaps undetected, maybe this has a chance to him. Who knows? Olaf will have no idea that he's already made his way in. Needs to be quick to find that kill, however. Definitely spots him. Oh, not only does he spot him, thank you very much! Oh, wow, no way. No way Line he wins up. this. And not only that, he's caused a full rotation from Ivy, from Rain, and sort of Z inside of Z Connector. Flushek gets one more kill on this. Lekro's got the whole map to play with. Oh he's hoping that Flushek can anchor this position down, but he has the option to go back to A. And look at Flushek. Oh my god. This would be a harsh reset on 14 rounds for Fnatic. And that smoke is tantalizing! Oh! Flush, uh, he's gonna clean out Connector. It's just Nico yet again who has to try and pull it back. And he's got the AK-47, some utility in a kit to do so. And Lecro is taking his sweet time to make sure he figures this out. Now this is interesting because now it's return favor. Nico snuck around behind Flusha. And he could actually spoil the whole plan as sneaky as Flusha was. No way! Oh my God! That is one of the most impressive clutches you will ever see. My god, Flusher, what was that? And Ace as well to do it. So sick. We even brought that up. He said, well, it won't do much for him here, but if he does get to the backtracks, maybe there's a chance. And my god, if ever there was one, he will capitalize on it. Flusher saves the day and maybe the championship for Fnatic here. Money in disarray for phase once again. That's the four. And already losing out on Draco is pretty big. That's a good answer from Dennis, though. Gets himself the rifle still to stick by his side rather than losing out where is this 4v4 but you can see now liquid bringing their forces together and dennis again is going to be called upon to do a lot of work and he's up to the top oh oh the third as well for dennis still stood no chance in the end he is starting to come alive as twist is in the 1v4 one minute left bomb is truly in nip's den and i don't see a way back in for twist kills kills is what you hope for if you're twist don't let the money build up there's the first on the forest. That one's easy. Still plenty of HP, still some utility. He's gonna peek out towards lane now with a the flashbang. There's three on this side. Such a small chance that he can actually win this. It would have to be some kind of miraculous lineup. I don't even know if he would ever even expect. Dennis is going for the ace. Smoke out. He's gonna peek with it. And he did for Team Liquid. This is not easy, even with the timing between the peaks. Even with each and every Liquid oh. play.